out of his mind. Since we can look here out here, keep the eagle, it's calling him out. Some water around here. 
We gotta get some order around. Okay, looks like uh, Freak Daddy, AJ Frost, he's in here. And uh, then you got the Golden Gladiator number two. And then you got on the other, and Chief J Eagle on one side. Then you got Boogie Woogie, Bootleg Dave, and that uh, his cousin. Well, I don't, I don't know. There's too many people out here ringside, but. Let's see, we've got the. Uh, oh, what in the world? Oh, is wait a minute! Wait a minute! It looked like Boogie uh, uh, did some uh, some physical uh, organization on AJ Frost. Holy cow! <laughs> He lost his mind. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it looks like he got the golden platter in too. Man, Boogie Woogie. Is, I didn't know Boogie Woogie was a doctor. It looked like he's giving everybody prostate exams. I had to knock Boogie Woogie out if he did me that way. I ain't never known he was a doctor. I hear a while back, I got one of those done and like to destroy the table uh, from a cold-handed oriental lady. Oh, wow. Mm. Now it looks like A.J. Frost wants to set Boogie up for a strength, a, a test of strength. <laughs> <laughs> I stuck his... <laughs> He's like he's trying to tickle him a little bit. Up on his arms. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. I did now with Boogie's antics so far. Oh, Boogie got him by the nose. Oh, yes, he does. He got him by the nose. And the gladiator accidentally. Boogie, what? Oh, 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 oh. Man, now he looks like he's grabbing him where the sun don't shine. Whatever he's doing, it looks bad. Oh, oh, oh no, no. He got a double handful. Oh my goodness! Got a double handful. He done lost his mind. Oh my goodness! A double, a double noggin knocker. I can't even color commentate on that. This is. But now we got the two masked men in here, and man, I tell you what, this match here is gonna be something. Very illegal, downright nasty looking. And I'm looking at this mask and I feel like I need a mask on. <laughs> like I said, you got both masked men going at it. Glad was it a uh, Golden Gladiator number two going up against one half of the Moonshiners, and that's a big boy. Tommy drop. Got him in trouble. Woo. After that uh, doctor exam and then a big knee, man, he ain't gonna be able to sit down for a few days. Man, he is going all the way around there. 
I mean, he is literally beating some sense into him. He is making him kiss every last turnbuckle. Yeah, he is. And that, that's the man in there. Not, they call him Big Nasty. That, that's the time they call him because of bootleg or whatever. They call him Big Nasty, huh? Yeah. But uh, I, I don't know. It's something wrong with them people up there where he come from. Yeah, well, that's a different part of the mountain, uh, you know. <laughs> and here comes everybody's favorite drunk, Bootleg Dave. And I don't know exactly how you can have a favorite drunk, but uh, he's definitely pretty popular down here in APW. And Frost comes in with the uh, the save. Yep. And this thing is beyond chaotic. Is it? AJ Cross is in here now. He's trying to break the eye of the Bullet Dave. Oh man, he is really working on Bullet Dave over in that corner. Oh. AJ trying to get a fit here. Oh. I don't even know how to describe this thing. Man, oh, now here we go. AJ done tagged in Chief A. Eagle after he made bootleg kiff, uh, kiss Chief's boot. Now, wait a minute. Now, now, there goes the Chief again with that fork. Well, can you imagine 20 years from now sitting down with your child making him watch this match? Man, I don't... <laughs> I don't even know what to say. This is just... Yeah, I imagine you wouldn't know what to say the NR now. AJ Frost is in here now with Bootleg Dave. AJ Frost coming off the ropes. Trying to get Bootleg. Oh, goodness. Atomic dropping to the ropes. Oh, my goodness. Another one. Bootleg Dave is looking like he's trying to get. Well, it looked like he was trying to get fired up. Now he comes up here with a, a blatant choke right in front of the referee. Yeah, this has been downright wild. Well, when you got a match with the Boogie Woogie, man, what match ain't going to be wild? Well, that's, I don't know. <laughs> exactly. So you're looking at over 30, 30 plus years of every match with Boogie Woogie has been, uh, been just absolutely nonsense. Got a bootleg on the rope, and he comes off the rope. Oh goodness gracious! Drops a vicious leg on the back of the back of the neck of bootleg Dave. Well, bootleg Dave, he's definitely in the wrong side of town now. And he knows it. Oh yeah, he knows it. And he definitely feels it too. Huh. 
know Bootleg Dave definitely needs to make a tag. I do know this much. Oh, good clothesline there by the, uh, the I'll just say the Golden Gladiator. Golden Gladiator. Splash. Got him on a big splash. And AJ Frost doing bootleg a few licks. Oh, goodness gracious. I think that might have took everything out of the tank of bootleg Dave putting that boot on AJ Frost. And that's saying something about Bullet David. His tank is empty. He's in bad shape. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah, I'm looking at him while ago where he fell backwards when he delivered that kick. That's why he looks about 3 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> oh, he looks like he makes a tag to Big Nasty, as they call him. Here comes Eagle. Eagle. Wait a minute, this thing done broke down. Wait a minute. Now, Boogie Woogie's in here. Dave's back in here. This is broke down. All three of them are clouded. It looks like we got some, what, triple sleepers. We got triple sleepers. Yes, we sure do. Yeah, it looks like a... It, look, it, it looks like Eagle's out. It, it looks like Frost is barely holding on. And the Golden Gladiator, he's out on his feet. It looks like Frost is the last one to hold on. I don't, I don't know. He, he, uh, let's see here. It, all right, it, that's one. If it, here we go. It drops two. If it drops one more time, that's it. That's it. That's it. That'll do it. What? Jay Eagle. <laughs> Jay Eagle with Golden, Golden Gladiator and AJ Crosser. They are laying out, brother. They are sleeping. Oh, some loud. Those boys are asleep. They're still sleeping. Hey, this is Del Wilkes, and I want to thank John Toomey for all the great artwork he's contributed to Behind the Mask, Del the Patriot Wilkes, and also to just the wrestling business in general, man. You do a great, great job, high-quality, first-class stuff, and everybody can check him out at ToomeyDrawings.com. Check out his stuff, man. It's world-class. Thank you. Biggest nights in the 2021 APW right here. It's already rocking and rolling. Falls count anywhere in the building. Brian Bullet and Chris James taking on Ted Cole and Solomon Gilgore. And I tell you what's the truth. Boogie Woogie Man was Boogie Woogie in his butt off tonight. Yeah, he was. But now we got some serious business going on in this ring. Chad Cole and Legion Kilgore, the champion, going against Brian Billick and Chris James in a false Count Anywhere match. Now, I tell you what, this, oh, Lord, and they're already looking under the ring for some plunder. This is not going to be for the faint of heart at all. And, ladies and gentlemen, uh, <laughs> if you sit in ringside, you might want to move somewhere else because uh, it's going to get up. 
We already got Kendall's picks and look like we got chills already. This is not gonna be for the faint of heart. No, it's gonna be rough. And Buddy Burke is trying to leave the building, but what uh, are you trying to leave the building? You're coming over to say hello. Danny Parrish, I am appalled at the way I was treated here tonight. Well, uh, what, what, what's your problem? I am absolutely appalled at the way I was treated by the board of directors of APW tonight, and I have a good mind not to come back at all. Well, don't speak that up a little bit louder and see what the crowd thinks about this. I don't care what this here Billy crowd thinks. I do what I want, and I go where I want, and I do what I want to do, and I don't care what anybody thinks. You've known me for almost 30 years, Dan Ferris. And I go where I want, and I do what I want, and I say what I please. And that is a mighty ugly, ugly orange sweater that man has on there. If he had any class at all, he'd have a red and black Georgia Bulldog hoodie on. Now, I'll tell you what, now, uh, Buddy Burke, when you came in, I, I thought the world of you, man. I had high expectations. You're going to call this thing right down the middle. And then somewhere along the line, you didn't go straight. You took a hard left. Well, you know what? If I wanted your opinion, I'd ask you for it. What do you think about that? It doesn't matter what you think. Just shut your mouth and know your role. Well, now, see, that's what I'm talking about, Bertie. You... Well, ladies and gentlemen, we got the ex-commissioner here, Mr. Buddy Burke, sitting with us here. And uh, while he's here, we've got some heavy-duty action going around this arena. We got a fight over here by the concession stand. We got a fight over on the other side of the ring. It's complete chaos, but it's come to this. It has come to this between these four men. You see what happens when I get terminated as commissioner? There's total chaos in APW. This is what happens when I'm terminated from that position. Well, this is going to pieces already. Chris, they're everywhere. Oh man! Oh, good lord! Good lord! Yeah, they are everywhere, man. This is this is crazy. You got you got folks over there fighting on the other side of the arena, and you got man. This is just just total and complete chaos, man. I mean, this is just this is like being in the wild wild west. It's just lawless. Almost. Mm, almost. I hope they can get people back to where they're supposed to be. I mean, I, I hope that there ain't no women and children around because they're gonna get they're gonna get caught up in this mess. Uh, possible. I mean, who knows? I mean, this guy. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Just, just, wait a minute! Did they just go in the bathroom? Sure did. Oh Lord! I hate to know what's going on in there. Yep, I, I don't know. <laughs> Man, I tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, this match has really broken down. I mean, like I said, you got action every. Oh, good lord! Kilgore with that kendo stick on the back of Chris James. My goodness, this is. <laughs> Please stay away from the wrestlers and get back in your seats. Okay. This is just too much, man. This is just complete and total chaos. I mean, the crowd is just, oh my gosh. Finally, we're getting back in the ring. Oh my Lord. Man, now Chris James with a little bit of payback on the champ, Kilgore. Yeah, oh, and that goes uh, Chris James to the outside. And, and wait a minute, now on the other end of the building, you got Brian Billick and Chad Coke going in the bathroom. Man. This is just too much action. Wait a minute, we got a pin. 
Well, we had a pin by uh, Kilgore on Chris James on the outside by the entrance. And now Chad Colton, Brian Billig have come out of the bathroom. Oh, brother. Man, this is just this is just chaotic. I mean, this is just absolute chaotic. This is just oh lord. Beyond description, almost. Oh, oh god! They're over here by the timekeeper now. This is now. Wait a minute! Now you got Chad Cote over here beating on Chris James. This is. Damn, this is, I've never seen, I, I'm ne oh my God, I've never seen nothing like this. I've never in my life seen nothing like this. Chad Code is over here now. It looks like he's going over to the concession stand. I don't know if he thinks Chris James is hungry or what, but, oh, man. Chad Cole asked. This is. I, uh, uh, uh. Oh, man. Brian Bullock takes the champ shoulder into the ring post. And shoulder versus Steel. And I tell you, uh, Steel's going to win every time. And now, that looks like Chris James got Chad Cole over by the concessions. He's working him over. And Kilgore looks like he's trying to get some revenge on Brian Billet. And wait a minute. It looks like Chad Coat and Chris James are back over by the bathroom again. Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I think we got one, one referee, don't we? No, we got two referees. That's what I said. We got more than. <laughs> wait a minute. Now, now, wait a minute. Now, what is going on in the bathroom? They keep going in that bathroom. <laughs> now they're coming out. Uh, now, Dan, have you ever seen anything like this in all your years of commentating? Oh, yeah. I have. Well, I definitely. Oh, Lord. Now it looks like Kilgore's got a, about to introduce a chair. My God! Th that thud that you just heard, ladies and gentlemen, was Chris James getting slammed on a table that didn't give. And if you heard that crack, that was Brian Billett's head getting thrown into a chair. And then Chad Colt tried to pin Chris James on that table. Oh my God, this this is, oh. I, I, ladies and gentlemen, I can't make this action up. I cannot make this up in my wildest dreams. What yeah. about you, Dan? Nobody can. I mean, usually when something like this happens, there's fines or suspensions. But here's the thing, this is unsanctioned. The athletic commission don't have nothing to do with it. APW, they said they washed their hands of it. This is just beat down your opponent until somebody either quits or gets a pinfall, basically. Well, sometimes, I don't know, commission gets in a, involved and gets very ugly. Well, this is, this is ugly, all right. This match is ugly, and I mean bowling shoe ugly. Ooh. Oh my gosh, Kilgore's head went right into that doggone chair from Brian Billy, and now we got a little action in the ring, and I tell you what, Brian Billy's got a reverse uh, chin lock on uh, Kilgore Legion, the champ. And while that's going on in the ring, I'm for good Lord, Chad Cope been outside in the parking lot with, with Chris James. Man. 
I'm, I'm trying to call this as best I can. Oh, good Lord. Here we go. With the pin, Kilgore. He, Billy grabbed the rope to break the pin. Ladies and gentlemen, please excuse me. I'm trying to call this action the best I can with my partner, Dan Perry. This is insane. I have seen some crazy stuff in my day. But, oh, good Lord. What, what was that? Outside, it's outside, it's everywhere. Yeah, but but it's all legal. Yep. It's all legal. I mean, you can do whatever you want. That's the thing. And it looks like Kilgore is trying to slam Big Bang Billy. Uh, good luck on that one. Brian Billy stepping on the champ's head, trying to squish it like a grape. Oh my God. And it looks like Chris James' head is just, oh my God, just broke the chair. And Chad Colt hit him with a kendo stick to, for good measure. And like I said, all this is perfectly legal. Hey, let's see, they got him duking it out. Thank you. Looks like Brian, but wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, oh! Oh, sit down, power bomb by Brian Billy to Kilgore. He goes in for the pin. Only a two count. Wait a minute, wait a minute. It looks like Chad Cole's got a chain and he's choking Chris James with a chain. And ladies and gentlemen, like I said, this is perfectly legal. This is unsanctioned. The state commission, APW, has nothing to do with it. Both parties. Oh, and it looks like Chris James is calling to come more by Chad Coke. Is he going to tap? Is Chad Coke going to give it up and tap? Who's got an arm lock? Got... Chad Cole has a Kamora arm lock on Chris James. Oh, good Lord, man. It looks like he's passing out. I don't think Chris James is going to come out. No. He's got a little bit left. He wrecks the eyes to get out of it. This is insane, man. Like I said, I couldn't think of this. I couldn't even make this up, ladies and Oh, Chris James with a chair shot to the back of the head of Chad Cole. Look at Chris James' uh, side. It looked like he's uh, really skinned up from a chair shot. Well, in a match like this, you're going to come out from worse for wear. It's going to change you as a man, as a person. A match like this. You will not come out the way you went in. You will definitely be a different person. And wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, good Lord. Big sidewalk slammed by Chad Cole to Chris James. And Kilgore Legion's up to the top. He's on the second rope. What is he going to do? Oh, big elbow drop. And he goes in for the pin. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's about to. Good Lord. He just made Chris James just taste Brian Billet. Good Lord. He just taste Brian Billet. This is just. Wow. This is. This is getting crazy. Chad Colt just tased. Brian Billet on the outside. Brian, man, this is. Oh my! Wait a minute! Wait! 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 wait. What does Chad Cole have playing? I see some handcuffs about to come into play. 
This does not. A nice kick there by uh, Kilgore. And Brian Billy kicks out it too. Wait a minute, looks like Chad Coates going. A big choke slam on Brian Billy. And Chris James has been handcuffed, so he's out of the equation. Oh, goodness gracious. And that's it. That is it. It is over, ladies and gentlemen. I tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, this, the, these four men put everything on the line tonight, and neither one of these men will come out the same. I promise you this. And now we'll be back after these short messages, ladies and gentlemen. back in a moment. Hi everybody, I'm Rhonda Bragg and I'd like to invite you to come on down to American Pro Wrestling every Saturday night, bell time, 8 p.m., doors open at 6.30, Bowling Springs, South Carolina, 122 Builders Court. We are social distancing for right now and mask required for right now, but maybe not always. So come on down to see us every Saturday night, American Pro Wrestling, Come on down for lots of fun. Oh, yeah, all the way. All right, fans, here goes our semi-main event right here. Taking a look at the... Uh, Antonio Morgan taking... Bubba Hog and um, Bubba Hog has uh, has lost a tremendous, tremendous amount of weight. Morgan, 
I, I'm, I'm sitting here pondering. I've never seen him before. He uh, he's new here. Uh, I want to I want to think he's come from the Columbia, South Carolina area. I, I'm thinking. I'm, and. Uh, Bubba Hog, in the meantime, in trouble. He just caught a couple of arm drags. And, uh... He's, uh, he's lost a lot of weight. Uh, and, uh, and as usual, Bubba Hog, I mean, I mean, I mean Mean man, but I can't get that out for some odd reason. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, fans. <laughs> Sometimes tickling myself on some tide. But I uh, saw Bubba Hog here a few weeks ago and. He was telling me he planned on coming back to wrestle here. I didn't know where. He said, at the time, he was like, I don't know when, and I don't know. Uh, I don't know if it'll be it is, is it summer or before summer. But I'm, but I'm glad to see he's back. I think. Uh, Oh, it was the one time a former APW heavyweight champion too. Try to re-enter the ring. Double axe handle. A lot of things happening here tonight. Referee has been arguing Bubba Hall. He had stepping on him. On his chest or his throat one, I couldn't tell, but uh <laughs> Bubba Hogg is a dangerous man. Really quite a kind of a short whipping lariat. trouble here. Let's go! Let's go! Morgan trying to go for it. Yeah, he, he didn't get it. Fisherman suplex. Hey, he got it.
dog put up a fight too. Ladies and gentlemen, every Saturday night right here in Bowling Springs, South Carolina. Come down and be with us. We'll give you a Saturday night you'll remember right here. Ten dollars at the door, five dollars, kid. Come in. All seats are general admission. Love to have you. Have a good time. You wish you did. Man, look at this right off the bat. It's a. Uh, Oh, wait a minute, look at that. Joey Reimer teaming up with Jet Morris against Squeaks the Clown. Uh, man, their partner, Squeaks' partner, is Damien Legion. I don't know who the case is. There's so much happening. Sound like chaos. Everything going on at one so going time. Just, I, man, two of them. Man. Uh, I tell you, this is crazy. to pick him up, threw him like a flapjack, but instead he hit him with a forearm all the way down. Man. So we saw this crazy night of action coming up the 27th here in March. We'll have the uh, Bunkhouse Stampede. And also, there'll be, you know, Summerhouse runs some other big events. So, be on the lookout. Man, down for Squeak's head, but awful. How the world is good? Oh, there's some kicks and punches. Oh, okay. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. Damien Legion going to take you in. Yeah. Oh. Man, this is a brawl. Uh, street fight, six man tag. And Joy Reimer unloading. So much happening here lately. 
This one, uh, every once in a while they put together a big, big night like this. And big special matches and knock down drag outs and just, but still, sometimes you can't figure out how you can get it done. All done, all done. All done. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, I mean, so that snap suplex. Oh, he did another snap suplex. Uh, that's a two. Uh, well, uh, that's two Los Amigos, whatever. Three Amigos, something, I can't say that. Let's see how we can we just turned around us. Finale on tonight's card. <laughs> and Joey Rimer getting a little bit of a a lick in here. Frustration, and I know there's the Eagle stopping by us. So. <laughs> Make sure I'm awake, I guess. And All right, we had a power slam. <laughs> That'll wake you up sometimes, even when you're not asleep. All right, let's see who tries to get a tag. <sighs> Joey in bad need of a tag. Joey's trying really hard to tag out. Yeah. Whoa, wait a minute, Squeaks is in there. He's coming in there. Man, he's doing some damage. I don't know what, he was throwing some fists. Jed Morris came in for a minute. Flying since on. Uh, 
I'm sorry I'm missing out something. There's a, a the referee here has had some problems with his counts at times, and uh, I'm wondering if there's going to be some something brought to address that. I, I don't know. It's a two count. My buddy Chris is going to the bathroom and must have got lost. We do have a tag. Super kick. Oh, we enjoy Rhymer. They mean Legion must go over the top rope together. Jet Morris goes from a reverse choke slam down. Oh man, that's gonna do it. Robbery. Man, what a fantastic night. American Pro Wrestling. It looks like we're going to call it quits. And yeah, we will be back very, very soon. And we will see you down the road, fans. Until next time, Dan Paris saying so long for now. Good night, everybody.